the game is basically power wash simulator but we work for the mafia dear player step into the world of crime scene cleaner you date a typo from the title of your game in the intro dude Immerse yourself in the captivating world of sh shady cleanup. Thank you for giving it a go. This version will allow you to peek at the challenges of this unique profession, introducing you to the features available in the full game. The fucking uh, wallpaper is that was really good. Let's go. <laughs> it's open. Just come in. Hey yo, right, really good cutscene for an indie game. Let's go. Be in a few minutes. Do you want something to drink while waiting? Oh boy. No thanks. Oh, that look, that's so badass. <laughs> no thanks. Bang. That's so, that's such a cheesy action movie line. I love that. Oh, no. Oh, not the kid as well. Wait, what's going on? I need your services, man. Son of a bitch was having an affair with my wife. Hey, yo. Hey, yo, that, that's actually so fucking badass. Uh, next to nothing. All work, no pay makes you a poor boy. <laughs> okay. I mean, it's a, quite a cozy apartment for a guy that cleans up after the mafia. <gasps> we have a doggo. Uh, Dexter, what are you All right. Doing, boy? All right. Best game, 10 out of 10. Best game, game of the year, 10 out of 10. My review is done. <laughs> man, that that's a, that's a bachelor's fridge right there, man. That's a real bachelor's fridge right there. <laughs> Okay, so this is not where I go. Is this supposed to be my wife? <laughs> I mean, out of all the stock pictures, you could have you could have gotten a better one. Like, come on, man. <laughs> all right, what do we have here? Cleaning service needed ASAP. Let's go. It's five body counts. How many? How many people are in that house? Really cool game, by the way. But man, indie productions have been going so good. Look at all these animations. They're like cinematic. It's like so cool. Version of it. <laughs> wow. Wow, that's that's a lot of blood. How do you how do we even get this much blood? I mean, let's just get right into it, I suppose. Don't worry, ma'am. We'll get you, we'll get you, we'll get you uh, you you feel like just sorted right now. Don't you worry about it. Yeah, I I'm pretty sure somebody Oh. Oh my my thing is all dirty now. I suppose I gotta collect this rash as well. That makes sense. I mean we don't listen, we don't wanna be the next crime scene, you know what I mean? Pull out the bag. So where's the body though? Like the body is not here, is it? Oh, it is here. Yeah, there's the body. It's one of the bodies at least. Uh, how do I open this? Can I just? Okay, how do I open this electronic box? Oh, UV lamps. Okay, we can see the blood as well. I'm thinking about like a criminal, right? Like, how do I get in here? Can you use the UV lamp for fingerprints in the door panel? Good idea. No, apparently we can't. Pressure washer. See, it is just like Power Wash Simulator. It really is just like Power Wash Simulator. We don't have to find a way to get inside or inside of the pool. I want to actually like... Ah, there you go. See, I knew I was doing something wrong. There you go. Clean it all up. Okay. Almost done with the pressure washer. Cleaning up a crime scene is surprisingly re relaxing, if I, if I if I have to say so. Oh, there you go. That's my trash. I was looking for that. I know what I need to do. I need to take it away with me, I think. Yeah, I need to take it away with me because otherwise, like, it's just gonna be evidence. Okay, is it all cleaned? I think so, right? Do I have the... Do I have the body bags? Do I need to cut up the body? Maybe I need to cut up the body. Well, what do I do with the bodies, though? Uh, just put it in the car, I suppose? I kinda wanna smash it, but I'm here to clean up the mess, not make more of it. Where do I go to find the... What is this? Incognito mode. What is this? Is this like polishing? Why does the guy have like... This is like car polisher and toilet paper? What was this dude doing out here? What was he doing with car polisher and toilet paper? <laughs> car polisher? Dude, I am sorry for your skin. Guys, lube is not that expensive. You animal. All right, so where do we get in? I suppose we gotta get in through a window, right? Oh, oh no. Oh no, I don't think- Oh no. I don't think I was supposed to do that. How do I get into the house? That's a real question. Is him in here? Heart. Maybe the pool boy has a key on him. Maybe the pool boy has a key on him. I kind of already bagged him, so... Okay, so we gotta get in here. But how? <laughs> okay, I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. <laughs> like, where- Oh, of course. Also, let me get a bucket so I can clean up this moth. It's- Annoying me mostly. There you go. 
It's very hard to clean. Come on, clean it. Clean it already, please. Oh, I gotta put detergent first. Okay. Wait, that's not it? That is not it, I think. Oh, well. Okay. Oh, God. Now that is a... Wow. They were really trying to, to make this as spectacle as possible. Like, you don't need this much. Really making a statement with that scene? I know, that was... <laughs> me on a bad day? That is not period blood. <laughs> you guys are the worst. Uh, let's clean up this art project. Wait, get up. No, pick it up. This is quite relaxing. I'm going to be honest. <laughs> totally recommend. Very, very good job. I mean, pays better than being a teacher. That's for sure. I suppose this is because it has like fingerprints and shit, right? We need to take everything that is involved in the crime that like could identify us, I suppose. I don't know exactly. I'm going to be honest. I have not been in many crime scenes in my life. And by many, I mean none. Sauce. I'm not being sauce. Listen, would I ever lie to you? If I was ever involved in a crime scene, do you think I would lie to you? Did I break something? I did. Do I gotta pick it up now? I did. I can't break things. Oh, that makes sense. I can't break things. If I do, I gotta clean it up. My bad. <laughs> there you go. Clean up everything. <laughs> I really don't care. I'm gonna be honest. Fine, I have to clean it up, I suppose. Knife my wife. What? What kind of book is that? That is that is a red flag and a half. Wow. That one was torture. Yep. All right, boy, you come in with me. Dude, I'm, I'm so happy that the game doesn't, like, uh, require me to, like, leave footprints. You know, if I make mess things up, like, my own footprints, that would have been very annoying. All we need, like, just to finish up is just, like, to find this chair and then we'll be done. Oh, where's the chair, though? Wait, where's the last chair? There's a chair that's out of its place. We seem... Oh, of course. Listen, I have low attention span. Don't criticize me, okay? I know you're gonna be criticizing me. Don't, don't, don't. He knows about us. Stay safe, my dearest. I hope to be with you soon. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I hope to be with you so I guess they are now. Happy ending? So much for healthy living. Personal notes. What will I do to improve my life? Keep a healthy diet, do workouts at home, focus on therapy. I mean, don't get involved with the mafia's wife. He is a really good way of staying alive. <laughs> Oh, wait, what is going on here? What is going on here? What is going on here? Oh, look at that. I understand now. I understand why the mafia guy is going to get mad at us. I mean, we're just stealing everything. What else do we have? Eww, oh, Jesus Christ. Just imagine playing some FPS and ending up with a bullet in your head. That's what I call immersion. I love how the game has a really good sense of humor. <laughs> Imagine playing FPS all day and then you end up with a bullet in your head. <laughs> Come on, dude. You're a professional. Why are you saying these things? <laughs> yeah, let's clean up the gamer room. I'm glad it's blood and not something else, you know? I'm glad it's blood and not something else. That makes it a lot more bearable, if I have to be honest. Listen, you, you turn on a UV light on a gamer's room, you're gonna be seeing a lot of things that you wish you didn't have. He was a streamer as well. Yeah, look, he has a green screen and everything. He was a streamer. The fucking, the fucking toilet paper again. God damn it, this is a gamer's room. Oh, there's a body. To be careful so she doesn't Kara, are you there? The yeah, what up, babe? Back. I'm freaking right now. I think daddy's having an affair. Overheard him talking to some women on the phone. Was a mom, I'm sure of that. Don't go crazy, girl. Probably nothing. I don't know. Maybe you're right. Maybe I'm just tripping. For sure. <laughs> very relaxing, isn't it? Just like a Saturday's day work. I also love how the scrub daddy is very sus. You know? The scrub daddy is just looking at me like, what are you using me for? Scrub daddy cleans your house, murder scenes, and more. <laughs> All ducks have highly waterproof feathers. A duck's feathers are so waterproof that even when the duck dives underwater, the downy underlayer of feathers right next to the skin will stay completely dry. Okay. I'm, I'm glad we're all learning about ducks. Oh, I know what I can use. I can use the UV lamp to, like, make it easier, right? Let me use the UV lamp to make it easier to find the, the rest of the blood. Oh. God damn it, man. <laughs> Why am I so clumsy? No! <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. Playing games for too long can kill you? That's such a boomer thing to say, you know. 
god, it's still more trash. Why don't gamers clean up their fucking rooms, man? There's three pizza boxes on its bed. Like, no wonder people get fucking, like, roaches on it, on their beds. Clean up your room, goddammit. Why does he have a microwave on his room? Dude, just go downstairs. Man, this, this gamer room is making me so upset. Ducks can live up to 20 years, I just learned. See? It's educational. You're learning a lot of things. You're learning how to dispose of bodies, clean up blood, how long ducks live. You know, just very informational stuff. What an educational game. <laughs> well, let's clean up the, uh, the last body. There you go. Now we finish off with the trash bag. And we should be good. Take photos in the swimming pool. Photos of what? Hey, what photo are we taking? Ah, I suppose we gotta prove that everything is like cleaned up, right? Take a photo on the first floor and then we should be done. There you go. Like a true crime master. All right. I think we should be good. I think with this, we should be all good. Oh, perfect stall, perfect stall. Hey, let's go. Perfect. 100% deceptive. Nice. I'm very good. I'm a very good crime scene cleaner. That, that's actually a really fun game. Wow, I it was really fun. Like the attention to detail is very nice. Like you don't you don't you can't make a mess. That was just the first stage. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a lot harder. I'm pretty sure that like there's gonna be a scene that like you're gonna have like a timer and you're probably gonna need it, right? Like the police is coming, you gotta clean up fast. Or like you know like there's gonna be like secret things. That's actually really cool. I mean, 17 grand just like that. Like you do a few of these and then boom, you're set for life. You know? God damn. What if we left the TV on? We did left the TV on. No. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, that's the prologue. That's the the, the demo basically. Uh, there's gonna be the the game out soon. Cream, uh, crime scene clean, cleaner. But really fun game. Really cool game. Really enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. So yeah. <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed.